Hi, and welcome back to your Dr. C's Morning Minute. Glad you could be here. We've been talking about self-esteem and bolstering such in your child. We've covered different areas in that respect, but one area we haven't talked about yet is depression and how depression will deflate a child's self-esteem. Depression typically stems from a loss in the child's life, or it can be biological, where it runs in the family. As, um, as we see with depression, it results in a child not being able to fully appreciate uh, positives. Glass is half empty. World is bleak. Um, even appreciating their achievements is very difficult. And they tend to, no matter what, no matter how high they may achieve, they don't fully recognize it. They minimize it. The therapy process actually um, utilizes many of the strategies and techniques that we've talked about over the course of the past, past four posts. In addition, the treatment process includes what's referred to as cognitive behavioral therapy, where we dissect, we attack, so to speak, these negative thoughts that are typically irrational, unreasonable, unrealistic, and we help the child to see things in a different perspective so they can fully appreciate their accomplishments. We also incorporate, this is vital, the, the parents, the family, into the treatment process, whereas depression will cause a child to want to avoid getting involved and want to avoid sports and clubs and activities and hanging out with their friends and doing things with the family. Well, we're going to um, utilize the family to, to compel the child to do just the opposite, to fight the depression, get involved anyway, even when the depression is saying, don't do that. And what we find time and time again is that even though the child may not be able to fully appreciate their accomplishments, we help them to move along the process, move along the way they, where they can more fully um, have fun, enjoy themselves, and see and recognize and appreciate all that they're achieving and doing. And that's the, that is how the process works, and it tends to be very, very effective. So any questions or concerns in that respect, feel free. Jay Carrasso at cpcwecare.com. See you next time. Dr. C's Morning Minute.